start recording. <laughs> I think I can just do right here. There we go. Things have changed a bit, but also like I recreated some of the stuff now that I've discovered how to save my room. Which direction is the microphone in? Uh, it's in this direction. Okay. Uh, roughly, oh god, this whole room is not set to the same orientation as my... We're like off. Weird. It's like diagonal. Well. Hung some stuff up. Took you at zero. Subnautica. I think I'll turn it around. Uh, I didn't like the audio last episode from the headset, so I I got my uh, shotgun mic turned on, but it's on the desk, and I can't tell where the desk is most of the time. So I don't know how this is going to turn out. It's a learning experience. Recording VR is fucking weird. Your Darkwood, your Fidel. Uh, getting artwork is a pain in the fucking ass, actually, if you want to edit, because you got to go things, artwork, community, and then it's like... Well, from where? Oh, you know, just every game ever. But, like... <sighs> we're still in the A's. <sighs> Alright, we're in B. <sighs> C. Oh, did we make it past D? Nope. Nope, still in D. That was a really good swing, but we didn't, we didn't beat it. <sighs> It also loads really slowly whenever you try to open something. I'm having difficulties with these menus. But yeah, like I have, uh, as you might imagine with my job, I have a lot of games and I don't see a search button anywhere and I could really use a search button because navigating the entire library manually, I have infinite, I have like practically infinite things in here. It's kind of a problem, honestly. Ugh. Anyway, back to what we were doing. Or what I was planning on doing with today's episode. And now I'm facing the desk. That's good. Okay. So f this direction, this one, this is, oh yeah, I can see the room. If that one slanted corner is on my right, that means I'm facing the desk. Good to know. Today, we're going to play Aperture Hand Lab, which was like Valve's little intro portal themed VR thing that wasn't the same thing as the one. That we already did that was like the intro this is like a different intro it's not confusing you're confusing it's not making things difficult uh <laughs> hopefully it loads the first time abduct it took me like 15 minutes to get abduction to load partly because i couldn't tell what was wrong what keeps happening are we okay are we okay oh hi robot detective Welcome, Sup. robot test subject, yep. to the Aperture Science Redacted. for the Classified of Word Deleted. You will not be told the purpose of your test today. We will not be told why you are performing them. To preserve the integrity of this triple-blind study, no one involved will have any idea why anyone is doing anything. For the purpose of this classified exercise, your barbed meat stripping claws have been replaced with hands. Please raise your hands up to your neck mounted weapons platform, which for the purpose of this exercise has been replaced with a face. Good. Where'd that go? Please exit the elevator. Where'd it go? Exit Where'd it go? The open elevator no, door. I lost my headphone. There we go. An earbud fell out. Through the only I need to put that you could possibly exit from. I need to put tape over my ears. Placed directly in front of you. So. You have not moved forward, which is a necessary component of this exercise. Now starting backup exercise, achieving excellence while standing in an elevator. All right, yeah, let's do it. I can do that. Good. By standing in an elevator, you have completed achieving excellence while standing in an elevator. Please move on to the next exercise, achieving excellence by exiting the elevator. Why does it say that? Who are you? Who are you Please correcting? Exit the elevator. Who are you correcting? You're not even still here, are you? Who's that the for? The will pause briefly until you've returned from the bathroom. Even though you really, really want to just tr trust me on this, you'll thank me later. Do Please not touch. Exit the Wait. Elevator. Yeah. 
Do not touch. How do I... I... You're right, I do not touch. What do I do? I think these hands have short fingers. Doesn't that seem small to you guys? Or do you guys have- or your hands look like that? I don't know. Oh! Good. You are now ready to begin the hand-assisted, non-verbal machine-human communication training. Please approach the training platform. Uh... I don't like heights. Please approach the platform. I'm locked in here. You have not approached the platform. I have not it approached the platform. Oh. Please approach it. You Can you fail to approach the platform? Yes. If you approach it now, you will succeed. Aha. Uh, can you uh, close the Do floor? This platform was designed to be approached. Can you close the floor? The floor is open. Can I, I don't want to walk up. No. Approach the platform. Okay, that not a step makes slightly more sense, I guess. Approach the platform. See, this is why I worry. What? The what? Why? Where's the, where's the scythe out there? Where's the scythe? I'm not coming out till you tell me where the scythe is. Or I am because I have an audience that I've already. Ah! All right. I apparently changed the distance between my lens without touch. I don't know how I did that one. Hi. We're really high up. I'll bring the human. Yep. I like you. So why looking, are you leaving? I'm looking. I'm looking up. To consummate this exchange, up. raise your hand, open it, then swing it gently from side to side. That is waving. It means you like me, like I like you, which I am demonstrating by waving. Oh, I'm, I'm approachable because I will not attempt to kill you. Note, wave only. Do not attempt to approach me, or I will kill you. I am very easy to kill right now. I'm a little afraid that if I approach you, you're gonna drop me down. Oh, no, I actually really don't like looking down. Oh, fuck. Oh, there's a see-through floor. Why'd you do that to me? Why is the floor see-through? I don't need that. We're really, we're really fucking high up. Oh, man. I am angry now. With the situation only, I still like you. Do you like me? Good. Signal this through the act of waving. No. My human feelings have Close the floor. The complete absence of waving emanating from your side of our wave exchange. How dangerous is it to? I can't approach you. <laughs> he said, "Don't approach him, or I'll kill him." And I'm like, "Let's troll the." Oh, I waved. Shit. I was like, "Oh, oh shit!" You murdered him. Oh. I'm Alan, and here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna shake my fist, this fist, at you. Uh, and there's not a thing you're gonna do about it. Shake, 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 shake. Okay, that's fine. You don't get to shake back. You just stand there. Oh, we're doing reverse psychology now. This is your world now. You think you're smarter than me? Shaking this fist. You think you can, like, trick me into doing it with reverse psychology? Who's playing golf? How'd they do- Wait, they got a hole in one. How'd they do that? I might be small and round. That just makes me three and a half round pounds of pure fish-shaking muscle. They said they'll kill me if I approach them. That's why. For one singular purpose. Shake, 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 shake. Oh, now you went and did it, didn't you? Did I? Well, Was that shaking? Is that shaking? You, think you got the answers. I change the questions. Double shake, double shake, double shake, double shake. You don't bring a knife to a gunfight, and you don't bring one arm to a two armed shake off. Double shake, double shake, double shake, double shake. I mean, I heard people buy VR to do that, but I didn't think we'd get there that quickly. You have to do a squeeze and swing. Back and forth. How can something so easy cause so good? Deploying next exercise. Hello, oh, hey, you're back. Friendly friend, who you murdered after I only wanted to be your friend. 
I clawed my way out of that pit of despair with a singular purpose. To come face to face with you once more and finally exact more friendship. It now, took you like 30 five. seconds. I haven't Good. touched anybody all year. I've been, I've been so lonely. Good. I've been, I've been so, it, 2020 has been so long. You understand how hard... Oh, this is your... <laughs> I have deceived you. Do you really think friendly Frank survived that fall? He's dead. You killed him. No, <laughs> I am deceptive David. Or is it Kevin? If not, or is it? I propose a game of deceit. It is a game as old as hands. A gripping trial of handly cunning called rock, paper, scissors. Hands are pretty old. Are you ready to be deceived? No? Good. On three. Ready? Hey, buddy. There's a Peabody. And hey. Over here. Reception is going to go a lot smoother if you Peabody. Let's just try this again. On three. I'm back. Three. One, two, Are you still here? Three. It's a contest of beasts. It requires some action on your part. We're close. We're getting it. We're gelling. Let's try this. If it's a contest of wits, you're about to run out. Uh, I accidentally made it in scissors. I am up here trying to. I'm really trying. Okay? I'm putting in the work. And what are you doing? Let's try this. What did I say? Oh, I can't leave. How did you do that? Don't go in for any of these opaque shenanigans around here. Keep clear. Is going to go a lot oh. If you participate, let's try this again. Yep. Oh, I'm closer to the cliff. No. Nope. nope. We're going back. We're going back real quick. Okay. Ah. Uh, I did it. Okay, now you're just looping. That bores me. You're boring me. On three. Ready? One, two. Ka. Chop chop. Nothing. Did I do it? Is going to go a lot ah. One. Yep. Two. Two. Three. three. Oh, there paper covers paper. rock. You didn't see wow, you did it. I only had to like I'm fucking touch you. And I win. Let's go again. There's two out of three. Ready? One. Two. Three. I. I won. I won. <laughs> Master of deception. Thank you. Thank you for leaving. Next exercise. It's my favorite thing about you is that you're not here anymore. Been hearing a lot of good things about your hands. Yeah. The head office. VP of sales, Ted Baker, said, Bill, you got to fly down there and you got to see these hands. And I said, Ted, you're lying and you're fired. But then I thought. They're not even my hands. Was willing to get fired over these hands. Maybe I better check them out for myself. So here I am. Let's see him, hotshot. Hold him up. Those are impressive. You made them, I think, maybe. Vice president in charge of hands. That's right. You heard me correctly. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yep. Grip it and shake it. Yep. Can you get that back? Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm going to need you to give that one back. Get Business hand. Give it the fuck shake. back to me. Business I need that for living. Get off of my hand, please. Yep. 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 That's a good handshake. That's a good handshake. Yep. 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 Best buddies. Yep. 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 I want to never see you again. How do I break your wrist? Oh, it goes every direction. He cheats. Dirty fucking. Business hand. Let go of me. That right there, that was great. Let go. If I ask you to gently caress my hand. No. Uh. Time, you give me a real handshake. A nice, firm, strong handshake. Really squeeze it. I can take it. Good, stronger business handshake. Oh, that's the, that's the microphone. I'm hitting the actually microphone. Actually strong business handshake. Hello? Good strong handshake. I'm gonna be blunt. Borderline insensitive. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, where'd it go? Oh, I didn't like that. Nope. Don't like that. Don't do that to me. Oh, that's the sound. Oh, hey. Are we on the floor now? I think we're on the floor now. Oh, that's nice. I prefer being on the floor. Friend. All I ever wanted was your friendship. But instead, you threw me away into a bottomless pit. And at the bottom of that pit, among these discarded robots, I found something even better than your friendship. This gun. Now you have no choice but to be my friend. And as your friend, I want to ask you one last friendly favor. Free me, or I will shoot you. Do you think Frank is bluffing? Jesus. That was merely a demonstration. Do not make me demonstrate again, because now Frank has some sense of how this gun works, and the next time I will not accidentally miss you. Now, pull open the drawer to your right and remove the envelope inside. And I trick him. And I trick him. Pocket, pocket, pocket sand. Uh, you can't see me. I blinded you. Oh, let me leave. Come with me. But there is no room on this harness for me and you and this gun. Wait, 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 wait. wait. We'll have to stay behind. Questions. Here is the emergency. I am pointing a gun at yeah. you. Friendly Frank is getting out of here. Oh, that's fucking startling. Open the drawer. I'm gonna close that back up. Open the drawer. Just gonna, just gonna keep that on a watch. Keep an eye on that thing. It's full of life, I guess. It's alive. Wait, what's that? I can't. What is that? It's immune to light. There's like a surface right here. But I can't see it. You're just the shittiest light, aren't you? Can I make you better at your job? All right, fuck. Good. Now reach into the drawer and grab the envelope. No funny stuff now. Good. Now tear the envelope open. Why does it look weirdly edible? Like a pastry. Reveal the envelope's contents until you have torn it open. This is just how Wait, envelopes hands. work. Yep. Hands are tied. Bye bye. If you happen to be a member of the press who is also in charge of your website's best game of the year list, remember this unforgettably <laughs> tense and heartbreaking envelope tearing scene. Your friend, award winning Frank. I threw it away already, buddy. Tear open the envelope. Ah! Good boy! Fetch! Oh, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? You can't. There you go. Now go, now go get it. I'm watching. Okay, now that's a... I'm a... Wait, hang on a second. You're not fetching. Bad dog. You're supposed to fetch. It's just infinite copies of the same envelope. <laughs> I can't hit him. Uh, underhand. Nope, that's not, I'm not any better at that. <laughs> I'm trying to help you. You need to help me help you. Hey. <laughs> just skip this whole process. I mean, it looks like a pretty thick envelope. Like, I could just... There you go. Do it. Just fucking do it. Do it. That's just the... We're just in the moment we're trying to see what has physics here. That is physics. The walls... Are, oh, that one's gone now. You disappear when I look away? Not yet. Is it like a, a cooling limit? Alright, let's play along. What's this? Oh. Oh, that's fucking creepy. Paper simulation. Inside the envelope is a very, very, almost absurdly large key. Do not let its comical appearance deceive you. It's good. Now free me. Or so help me, I will... I... Oh, who is friendly Frank kidding? No more guns. I am asking you, as a friend, Please, free me. Friendly Frank. Your friend. Place the key in the hole labeled Core Escape to complete Core Escape sequence. Or, place the key in the hole labeled Destroy Core to destroy the core. Friendly Frank was unaware that core destruction was in motion <laughs> and is beginning to regret holding you at gunpoint. Also, throwing away my gun. Yeah, you've made several mistakes here. Some of which are contradictory. Your biggest problem is infinite honesty. 
we should consider less honesty in the future. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. And now we can tell you the purpose of this triple blind test. Oh, good. Discovering the value of friendship. You have got to be kidding me. That's that is not even science. And by choosing friendship over the very real possibility of going to prison, you have passed. Oh, good. We passed. Test concluded. Deactivating test arena. Placing all robot participants in sleep mode. Thank you for your participation. Goodbye. Your agency was a myth all along. You're not even a per person. Uh. Yeah? Yes? Mm hmm. So, I. Are you in sleep mode? Friendly Frank is not. How long no. do robots live? I suspect it might be a very long time. I center myself. Okay. Right. I think this is going to be a real test of our friendship. Why isn't this light light things? I need somebody to explain to me. Oh. I guess we're done here. I guess that was the full thing. Just me and friendly Frank. In the dark hole forever. Like, worse things have happened, I guess. Not so bad. Yeah. Alright. 